Hey, welcome. Let's type the APN settings from Simple, Simple Mobile on this AT&T Prime phone. Okay, so let's go to uh, settings. Okay, so settings, and then uh, let's go to uh, more networks, and then uh, mobile networks, and access point names. On some phones, you wanna find as a uh, APN. Okay, so just select APN. Uh, on this phone, you need to touch the plus symbol to open a new window. Some other phones, you need to touch the three dots or the menu to open. It depends on the model. Uh, and on name you are going to set the following simple and then WAP okay simple WAP okay you're gonna type three APNs which is uh, that's uh, for this phone and uh, for sky phones blue phones and other like Alcatel um, Pop Astro and things like that. So, uh, APN, you want to enter simple or lowercase. Okay, then hit OK, select OK. Uh, we're going to set proxy, which is uh, 216. That 155. That 165. That 50. Okay, hit OK to save it. Port, you're going to select 8080. Hit OK. Uh, we're gonna leave everything in blank. Um, <clears throat> okay, MCC is 310. MNC, make sure that you enter 260. Okay, 260. Uh, that's for M Mobile Network Country for uh, Simple Mobile. And authentication type PAP. Okay, Peter Alpha Peter. And APN type, uh, we're gonna select default. So delete any value to so set default, comma, internet. Okay, some phones, uh, you wanna open, it's gonna open a window, okay, and you already have there the values and just need to check the uh, box. So uncheck any box, and if you don't see internet, uh, check the SUPL Sam Umbrella Peter Lorry, okay, and default and select OK to save them. Everything else remains as it is. If it asks you to turn on or off APN, set turn on, okay, and that's it. Let's go to the three dots on the right top corner of the screen. Other phones in the menu, uh, set OK, save. Okay, so somehow my phone didn't uh, save at the first time. If that happens to your phone, don't worry about it. Just open a new window and retype the APN. Uh, so when you get to this point, you're going to see a simple WAP. So just touch it to activate the APN. And then uh, you're going to touch the plus symbol or the three dots or the menu to set another window or new APN. And you're going to enter uh, simple and then underscore APN, okay, like that. And then uh, hit OK. APN set on simple or lowercase. Hit OK. And then um, authentication type uh, M -M MCC 310 MNC. Remember uh, to delete any value. Enter 260, 260. Hit OK. Authentication type uh, select PAP. Peter Alpha Peter and then APN type uh, just set as default okay default and then hit OK don't touch anything else just go back uh, and save APN okay okay so are you gonna get to this step okay um, so when you see the simple APN just touch it this is very important to keep this on. So this is the main source of internet on your uh, APN or phone. Okay, so if somehow switches to simple web, return and check the simple APN. Okay, now we're gonna open another window for M simple MMS for picture message. So let's type the name, which is simple, 
and then underscore m m s hit ok apn simple all lowercase ok and then uh, leaving blank leaving blank proxy port username password we're gonna select mmsc uh, we're gonna type the following address http then uh, column slash slash uh, smpl as a simple smpl dot mms dot um, msg dot eng dot okay so make sure you have it right on the window and then t-mobile t-mobile um, dot com slash mms slash wap enc okay so that's um, a hit okay uh, multimedia message proxy or mms proxy uh, we're gonna enter zero 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 okay five zeros uh, hit okay and then uh, if the value doesn't show zeros don't worry about it just leave it in blank uh, sometimes when you save it just uh, remains in blank when you enter zeros okay so multimedia message port is going to be 8080 MMS port hit ok uh, MCC 310 MNZ 260 uh, if your phone is unlocked or another from another country so edit those two ok 260 ok so your phone is from another country make sure that MCC is 310 ok it's from US alright so this is the values then um, now let's um, hit to authentication type and select PAP Peter Alpha Peter uh, APN type uh, delete anything like default or SUPL or internet and enter just MMS okay if you need to check a box just check MMS okay and that's it hit OK to save it uh, everything remains the same if it asks you to turn on or off APN make sure it is on and okay so let's go to the right top corner of the screen and save okay so you're gonna get to this point where um, you see the access point names and we see now simple MMS okay so if your phone do what I am so unfortunately I have to retype the APN but it's okay uh, so when you get to this point uh, simple MMS uh, has no circle okay so that's the way it is if you see a circle right here on the simple MMS that means that something is wrong with the APN so you need to go back and make sure that you enter the correct values that you went through and APN type has to be only MMS okay nothing else so at this point you should be able to see any internet signal from simple mobile if not just make sure to go back and mobile data is on um, the main settings and data usage uh, mobile data is on and uh, just reboot your phone and uh, try access the internet if you still not able to access the internet after do everything and reboot the phone go back to mobile networks network operators oops sorry network operators and at this point your phone will start searching okay or if there is a window just hit ok and the phone will start searching what you want to do here is register your sim card to the uh, simple mobile tower so uh, once you finish searching you're gonna see maybe T-Mobile, AT&T, Simple Mobile so just select Simple Mobile at the bottom uh, side of the phone you're gonna see a message saying register or network that means that everything is okay and if you get a message saying unable to register or network that means that or try second, third and fourth time if after, after fifth time you're not able to uh, get a positive uh, message then that means that you maybe your SIM card slot might be defective or your IMEI number needs to verify might be blacklisted so just uh, 
go to T-Mobile or call um, customer service or at and or any other uh, phone carrier or your in this case Simple Mobile or T-Mobile because you unlock this phone or if it's an at and call at and or Blue or uh, Sky have them verify the IMEI number um, might be on blacklisted um, database so uh, they will tell you what you uh, what do you need to do in order to remove your IMEI from that list okay and then uh, because even if you unlock the phone even you have reset it you won't be able to catch up any service uh, until they will remove your IMEI number okay so a picture message uh, if you're not able to send picture message have somebody to send you one first and then uh, try send one after that if um, you're not able to do it just take a picture and send it to your own phone number okay so that means the phone number associated with the sim card on your phone right now uh, and that's the way to activate the picture message alright so anything else any other questions that you may have um, please let me know on comments and uh, find my videos on how to have reset any phone when your screen is locked with a passcode password or pattern okay and thanks so much for choosing my video. Any other questions, let me know.